There have been a number of advances in skin tightening technologies, uh, most of which have become invasive, either in the form of a uh, thermi device, uh, face tight. These are, although they claim to be non-invasive technologies, involve incisions and instruments that are passed deep to the surface of the skin. Uh, this device that I've been using for many years that I still think is fantastic is all therapy. And the difference between the alt therapy and these thermi and uh, other face tight devices is that they are not invasive at all. And as a matter of fact, after the treatment, there's no downtime. The technology behind the alt therapy is actually quite clever. They have used ultrasound for imaging, but they've also used ultrasound to effectively burn uh, the deep tissue, uh, which leads to contraction and uh, skin tightening. The depth of the burning is controlled and it is at four and three millimeters and if we want to be in the dermis 1.5 millimeters which makes us a very versatile device in the lower face we can decrease volume by targeting fat we also target fat in the neck uh, and then with the more superficial treatments we tighten the skin and with the 1.5 millimeter we can even go after lines about the mouth uh, I've also used this device on the chest to help with the lines and the decollete, and I've been quite impressed with it. Uh, the treatment does require some local anesthesia, uh, but really is tolerated quite well, and the following day, you don't look as if anything has been done. We see improvement over a course of six weeks and three months, and um, it is ideal for people that are just beginning to show signs of aging, but are not quite ready for a surgical procedure, or people that have had a surgical facelift and are starting to see relaxation. So usually, you know, six, eight, 10 years down the road. The device can also be done multiple times. It's designed to be done once, but can be done annually uh, or every two to three years, depending on what's needed. Another area where I like to use all therapy is on the brow. Uh, I've, I've been able to see a few millimeter elevation. Uh, I've also done it for brow asymmetry. A number of us have one brow that sits slightly higher than the other. And so it's very nice to treat the lower brow with the asymmetry and see if we can get them more balanced. If you're interested in learning more about this, come and uh, give us a call because we are running a promotion on all therapy during the month of November.